quadruped upper versus lower spine mobility. So you're going to get into a hands and knees position, hands right underneath the shoulders and knees right underneath the hips. I'm going to try to dissociate movement from my upper back versus movement from my lower back. So this is very much so a coordination drill as much as it is a controlled mobility drill. So again, can I create motion in my upper back without creating motion in my lower back? And then vice versa, can I create motion in my lower back without creating motion in my upper back? That's a very important tool for us to have or movement option for us to have in order to have a healthy spine. So you might have to focus on the upper part or you might have to focus on the lower part. Sometimes it's helpful to just let them both flow together. Not pushing into end ranges, not forcing motion. Remember this is a controlled mobility drill. And now see if we can get them to dissociate. There's upper and there's lower. 